We're doing a quick recording here, and this recording is going to be about if you want to use 6-core 12-thread CPUs in any Dell Precision T30, I can't get this focus, in any Dell Precision T3500, for example, this here is W3680, uh, W3690 I mean, so this is a 6-core 12-thread CPU, it's a 32 nanometer process, but yeah, if you want to use it on any Dell Precision T3500, um, you need to make sure that your BIOS is up to date. Uh, for example, my BIOS currently is on revision A3. So this means that you will have to first, before updating to the most recent BIOS, which is A17 here, you will need to first run the A13, uh, yeah, the A, what is this? Uh, confirm, replace, blah, 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 blah. Okay, now we just pray that nothing goes wrong. But yeah, now we're going to be uh, flashing the BIOS to A13, and the reason you have to go from A3 to A13 to A17 is because, I don't know actually if you need to do A17 to support the 6-core 12-thread CPUs, but I do know for sure that you need to, um, you need to get off the A3 uh, BIOS, and I don't know why the screen just dimmed, like I swear it's going to be, it's going to continue working, but it's like for... I don't even know, but yeah, I just figured I'd mention that. It's that if you plan on putting a 6-core 12-thread CPU into a Dell T3600, you will need to update your BIOS, and you can't directly go to the latest version to that. Yeah, you can't directly go to the latest version, so. Yeah, I thought I'd make that video quickly, and an easy way to tell is just by checking here. At the front of the case, it should show you your manufacturing date. For example, this is from 2010, and... I also know it's an older system because it uses the aluminum pin stack instead of one of these really nice uh, copper copper uh, heat base plate things. Uh, but yeah, uh, just make sure you update your BIOS before replacing your CPU. Otherwise, you might end up booting or not being able to post and you'll wonder why. And, and the reason is you need to update your BIOS. So before you replace your CPU with the nice 6-core 12-thread processor, First, use your garbage dual core, whatever you get included, <laughs> and upgrade your BIOS. And remember, it's a two-step process. you got to go A13, then A17. And yeah, if you found this uh, helpful, definitely drop a comment and let me know. And uh, I wish you the very best. And if you have any questions as well, let me know in the comments. Thanks.